Here's how to fix an iPhone that won't turn off. Now, if you have your iPhone and as much as you try to turn it off, you're pressing the buttons, but it won't allow you to swipe to turn it off or restart it, I'll show you how to do that. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, the first and easiest way that you can turn off your phone is to head into your settings here and tap on general. And at the very bottom, you can see shut down. So you can tap on that shut down button and it will allow you to turn your iPhone off. However, sometimes this doesn't work or essentially the screen is glitching out and it's stuck or frozen. And there are other options you have. Now, the other option that you have is to do a force shutdown or a force restart. To do that, you're gonna tap the volume up button, tap the volume down button, and you're gonna press and hold that side button until you see the white Apple logo appear. So let me just end this screen recording real quick so that I can do this for you guys, make sure that is saved. And now I will walk you through the process. So volume up, volume down, and I'm gonna press and hold this. You'll see it has the ability to slide to turn off, but don't do that yet. Keep holding it until you see that Apple logo appear. So you can see it goes completely black. And then after that, you'll be able to see there's that Apple logo. I will take my finger off of there. And now it will force restart everything. So again, if your phone won't shut down by using these physical buttons on your phone, you can force it to shut down and force it to start back up. It'll walk through the entire process of rebooting your iPhone, and I'll show you just that it worked basically once it's rebooted, but then you'll be good to go to use it. All of it. Again, a lot of times if your phone is frozen or stuck, or if the touch screen it just isn't working, this helps to fix it. So you can see it's still on that Apple logo, and just like that, it is back up and running. I can start using my phone normally after that. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.